truth. Hey guys, it's Deshi and welcome back to another video. So today we're going to be playing Kami and the reason I'm saying Kami is because that is the newest skin in Paladins for Maeve. As you all know they have the Genlock update which is a crossover pass and I'm repeating myself but just in case you're new here and you've never seen this before. A new crossover pass called Genlock which is an anime which you should definitely watch if you haven't already. I still haven't watched it however I hopefully will before the new champion is released and I'll be able to see how linked that each champion is with the Me, characters Kami. in the actual game and today we're going to be playing Kami on here it looks amazing I really love all the skins on here especially the Zin skin the Zin skin and the Knessa skin is kind of a match mix up with Kami here that's something I've noticed they have something a bit of a casual outfit and then more futuristic when it comes to her torso area which is very nice and I can't wait to try it out and Obviously, before we get started, I'm with two people, Solar and Akram today, so hello to both. And we're going to hear some voice lines before we start the match. Wow, we really did it! Wicked! Don't leave me hanging, buy something! Oh. Got him! This round's ours! Just a wee bit of health, please! Far shots, eh? <laughs> Yeah, so I'm not sure what's the best way to describe Kami. She sounds almost like a trickster, someone who's very goofy, very fun to be around. She's a joker. That's what I'm getting from her, from her voice, from the way she speaks. I feel like she's a very fun character in the actual anime itself, and they try to portray that in the game, which is very good. Also, another thing I wanted to talk about is the fact that Maeve did get a Pick the OP one. change. I'm not sure if it was a buff yeah. or a nerf. But oh, she got yeah, a change and I'm not sure exactly like that what that hat. is. I'm going to put um, in the description below because I sadly didn't check it. But the reason I haven't checked it because I went straight to recording because I haven't been recording the actual gameplay in a while. As you'll notice, there's been non commentary videos and pre-scheduled videos. And also, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you probably wouldn't know why I haven't been uploading as often. But the main reason why is because I'm no longer going to be doing Paladin's edits. I know that sounds like, crazy as, as that kind of built my channel a bit and gave me some nice views and recognition. But I'm no longer going to be doing Paladin's edits no more unless it's involving a new champion. Which is pretty, you know, big I must say because I, I love to do a lot of Paladin's edits and... Not many people I've known do that as much as I do. I know a few people who make some very nice edits, post them on my story to give them some recognition and show how well they do. But I'm going to stop actually doing it unless it's a major edit or a new champion. If I wink out, you can have my manga collection. Reason why is because I'm starting to get, I'm starting to get a bit annoyed <laughs> of myself for just constantly doing edits. And yeah... I'm going to do a video talking about it more in detail, but yeah. First and foremost, the weapon. I love how it looks. I love how it has the same effect as um, Zin's. As you can see, when I jump, there's like a warp Battle's that goes with it, which is amazing. I love that green. Not the final green, but with this, I give it some props. It looks amazing. Let's look at the emote as well. Goes so nice. I love this skin. They did so well with the skin, I must say. But we're gonna look at more effects Three, while fighting. Two, also, just let you know, I'm not good at Maeve, so don't expect some good gameplay. <laughs> but I do love. I love the effects. I love the the effects on her. It's so cool, especially when you do the prowl. I love the look of the prowl. I love the look of most of the effects. I must say. It's probably one of my favorite effects in the game. Because I have nothing wrong with it, I must say. And I can't aim. Why can't I aim with Maeve? What the hell? Oh, the ult is amazing as well. 
I have been ulted by someone who had the Mave skin, but I never get to see it as my point of view, if that makes sense. So it's so cool to see it from my point of view. And Mave has gone stronger. Oh god, thank you Io, you saved my butt. <laughs> I'm not playing good at all here. Yeah, the effects on the weapon Enemy is pretty cool. Spree. It's not too loud. Ah. There we go, managed to get rid of the Knessa there. I love the U Rock right there. I've been playing too much of other characters. But I'm not doing too bad. I could do better, but I'm not doing bad at least. Okay, I'm not doing bad at May for once. I'm actually managed to secure a good amount of kills here. Oh, there you are. I'm out of here. I'm about to die. Uh, let's get life rip. I think life rip might help. Thanks. You're sweet. This Ayo is on me so good. I love it. Like, I, if Ayo wasn't here, I would be dead already. You can also at the same time. That 13. Okay, seriously? Only odds. Can't do 14 in a row? We don't, we don't congratulate you for even. Okay, almost. I'm doing alright. I'm not talking too much, but I'm doing alright. I feel like I've spoken enough about. I think I've spoken enough about. What's it called? I think. I'm not sure what I don't like about the skin just yet yeah I'm not sure what I like about the skin just yet because in all honesty a lot about the skin is pretty good the effects are nice and it's not too much as well yeah sorry it was saying yeah the skin it's not too over the top, like with most skins, because I've noticed with a lot of skins, it's so output in. I think the only thing that could be annoying is the override, but it's not as potent as on my side than it is on, let's say, the enemy side. Because as the enemy, you see a massive orange override, but on our side, or on my side, you don't. And it's also good as well to think about is that on the enemy side, you see a massive bright blue aura around them, making it easier for us to see them around corners. That's probably one good thing I must say. Okay, not gonna lie, with headphones on, the sound of the ult is very annoying. Yeah, screwed up. <laughs> I actually did screw up. Um, let's get veteran. Maybe that'll help out. This game went from just me reviewing the skin to actually being serious now. I'm on at 33 eliminations. Five solo kills. Oh my god. Accuracy. Oh my god. <laughs> I actually aimed. Oh my god. I actually hit her. That's five in a row. 
Since when can I aim? <laughs> I'm concerned about my own accuracy here. I'm not actually not doing bad at Maple ones. Does this skin give me good luck? Man. You saw nothing. <laughs> I'm actually not doing bad for ones, and I'm scared. Oh! <laughs> Are we just gonna ignore how that emoji just died right there? Sadly, that was a lost spot. That was actually a lot of fun. The Maeve skin is really nice. I do like it. The ult is a bit irritating on my ears when I have headphones on, but I'm not sure if it's more annoying if someone has surround systems or something else that doesn't mean that the noise is right next to your ears but i love the skin love the look love the effects it's not too much and too annoying i noticed i was able to bypass everything without complaining internally too much which is good but i really like the skin this is actually the second mave skin i like as you'll know if you know me well when i play mave i always play the pirate mave because that is by far one of the best skins for Maeve personally that's my personal opinion but I really love the skin I just love how it looks and I love the alt as well the music and alt amazing but stat wise that's the first time I did good with Maeve so I'm gonna take that with a pinch of salt because I know the next game I'm gonna mess up but anyways we're gonna jump straight to game two we're gonna do Kami again and I do want to focus more on the buffs and nerfs because I think Maeve did get a buff but I'm not too sure so I'm going to skip ahead until I find it because I'm actually pretty interested. Because I believe the damage bonus on Rose Gambit has been increased and they also reduced it by 2 seconds. That's one thing I noticed because I was using her pounce a bit more. But yeah so as it says here it says it increased the damage bonus from 10% to 15% and now also reduced the cooldown pounce by 2 seconds so not a single nerf for Maeve at all. It was just a very nice buff so that is really good so what we're gonna do we're gonna jump straight into game two and hopefully we could do a little bit better with Maeve even if I like did good but this time I'm gonna focus more on the skin and the voice lines because I didn't and I kind of feel bad for not doing it and at the end I'll be giving my overall ratings of the video alrighty so we got King and Hell Magistrate Archives which is uh, I'm not sure about this map <laughs> for Maeve but um, speaking of the so, the art behind Maeve, the transform version, I feel like it's a bit simple with this one. So this is definitely not going to be my favorite one to say, let's hopefully have this one. But in comparison to like the Zin one or the Knesset one, the Knesset one being more of a stealthy character and Zin being more of a meta human, like massive, beefy, like Transformer of Ultimus Prime. This one's just a simple... She put a bodysuit on like Iron Man. Not saying Iron Man is cool. Iron Man is amazing. But it's simple. So I definitely won't rank this as high as the other one. But again, this main skin is very nice. I really love it. But what we're going to do is we're going to skip straight ahead and actually try out some of the voice lines. And also see how the emotes look as well. Alright, so let's right look at some of the emotes on her. I love the green M. I'm not going to lie. The neon green is amazing. We Can I aim? Okay, I got obliterated. They're more mobile and I can't do mobile champions. I am so bad against mobile champions. But sadly, uh, taunts don't work. There we go. Finally got her. Oh my god. No, I still missed. How did I die like that? That's embarrassing. That was bad. That was in. I, I, let's not speak about that. Oh my gosh. I got nearly every shot apart from one. There we go. I can aim. <laughs> Takes three to five business days, but I get it. Oh my gosh. Can I just aim for one second? Finally. 
Can I chase that Maeve down? I love the I love the way she speaks when she's all in. Oh hi! There we go. Get rid of the buck there. Can I get rid of the service? Can I aim? Okay. I don't know what that happened. Oh. I don't know what happened just there, but that was a bit odd. Oh, I managed to survive that. <laughs> Lol. Not me not being able to aim. That actually hit. I just have a reward for that. <laughs> And that is another loss, sadly. I do I do love the skin. I really like the skin. I'll give it a nice 9 out of 10. I feel like this is probably one of the best pass, personally. I'm not too sure, but for me, I enjoy this one or the skins on this a lot more. Even though it's 750 crystals, which is blooming expensive, I do love this a lot more. The skins are very different. It's unique. It's a different style to what they usually do. And the fact that they did a crossover pass is a huge congrats to them they did very well and i can't wait to see the next event pass and what they're going to do i do hope they do more crossovers because that was amazing something similar to that like smite as well because their crossovers are pretty nice and i love the skins that they do on there but anyways that is the end of today's video hopefully i've all enjoyed do let me know what you think about Maeve. Do you like, or actually, Cammy? Do you like her or not? And what would be your rating on her? Also, in terms of the edits on my Instagram, I won't be posting on YouTube because my YouTube is mainly focused on gaming. So I won't be posting on there. So if you want to see my anime edits, definitely click the link in my bio to check out my Instagram. And you can see what I've been doing whilst I'm not recording. Anyways. Have a lovely day everyone and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.